couple days ago, Bitcoin hit a very important price target. And that's why in today's Bitcoin price prediction video, we'll talk about my exact bearish trading plan if this is now the top and also I want to show you precisely the next Fibonacci price target if we do go slightly higher in the next days. But first of all, what we are going to see. If we go on the weekly time frame right here, we can definitely identify a significant SNE channel. Now, we are using the logarithmic chart because we, of course, have very high volatility on Bitcoin. And it really looks like that when we are connecting our previous lows with a diagonal level, expanding this one towards our previous high, Bitcoin only a couple of days ago hit the precise top of our SNE channel approximately at 49,000 US dollars. Now, another level that was also hit literally almost exactly was the price target of the triangle. So when we go on the four hourly time frame, identifying an SNE triangle, that being said, making a resistance level approximately at 44,500 US dollars, connecting our higher lows with another diagonal level. This is the triangle that we already talked about a couple of days ago before it actually broke out. You can first of all see that we got a lot of fake outs. First fake out right here, get everyone bullish, dump it towards downside, get everyone bearish right here, and only then actually see a successful breakout. And when we are talking about the price target of our triangle, you are going to notice measuring the opening of our triangle, putting the trend line on the breakout right here, it really looks like that the price target on Bitcoin was hit almost, or I would actually say literally to the exact dollar accuracy. Now, when we hit the target right here, one of the very important indicators showed us that we might see a push towards downside. And that was actually the after stochastic CG oscillator on the daily time frame. We already talked about this many times on the channel because a double top pattern on the after stochastic CG oscillator is a bearish indication. And you can actually notice double top pattern formed right here. Price target of the triangle was hit right here. And only then we got a significant push towards the downside on the Bitcoin price itself. And with this push towards downside, as of right now, in my opinion, the top on Bitcoin can potentially already be in. And right now we are already due to a significant correction back towards downside, despite us not hitting a very important Fibonacci price target that we are going to talk about in the next couple of minutes. But First of all, I would also like to show you potentially a bearish indication that it is going to be confirmed in the upcoming hours and that is going to be using our exponential moving averages on the one hour time frame. Right here, you can already see that our 50 exponential moving average, which is the red one, is already seeing a cross, a bearish cross in fact. And when we zoom in a little bit, the green one and also the blue one are very, very close together, potentially seeing a cross in the upcoming hours, in the upcoming days, which that Definitely, it is going to mean on the one hourly time frame, Bitcoin entered a significant downtrend. So, I would like to show you the last time we got across because it happened many months ago. Even for example, right here, we were pumping towards the upside, we got a correction, no crosses between our green one and also between our blue one. Yes, we got many times where both of those exponential moving averages pretty much hovered right here. But to be exact, when we got a bearish cross, it happened the last time in July 2023. You're going to see right here, we got a bearish cross with our green and the blue one, we got a cross with our red one right here, and then Bitcoin suddenly entered a significant downtrend and got a a crazy and a significant push towards downside to approximately 23,600 US dollars. So I would actually say that if the cross is going to happen in the upcoming days, in the upcoming hours, this right here is actually going to be quite a significant bearish indication of Bitcoin because we are going to know we entered a downtrend on the one hourly time frame. So that is why I would like to share with you right now my exact bearish plan. And our bearish plan is going to be quite simple. That being said, the top on Bitcoin is right now in because as mentioned before, we hit a very important price target, the top of our significant SNE channel right here. And we can already talk about a bearish LEP account. So we can say we got the first impulse right here. As of right now, it looks like we are forming some kind of a correction. And then of course, another impulse on our correction and another impulse towards downside can definitely be 
expected. Later, we are going to talk about the exact invalidation levels and how we can actually trade this. But if you want to trade with us, 30,000 US dollar free trading bonus is right now available on Bybit. And if you don't want KYC, Bingex is right now offering a 5,000 US dollar free trading bonus with a cycle link down below in the description. Right now, let me do share with you what is going to be a theoretical price target of our second island wave before another impulse on Bitcoin can actually start. Now, theoretically speaking, the target, the first target that second island wave should theoretically reach is actually going to be 0.5 Fibonacci retracement level. So if we do go from our swing high back towards our swing low, it looks like that our 0.5 Fibonacci retracement level is going to land almost exactly at 45,000 US dollars. Now, remember what we said yesterday, we should also pay attention to some other levels. And this level is actually going to be our weekly level that was confirmed only a couple of hours ago. Now, I would agree with you, it's not a with our 0.5. It's actually going to be much closer towards our 0.32 Fibonacci retracement level, but nevertheless, I would say that if Bitcoin does continue its way towards the upside on very low volume, pay attention to our weekly, pay attention to our 0.5, and also I would actually say, pay attention towards the golden Fibonacci ratio if we are maybe going to go just slightly higher. But doesn't really matter at which level right here we are going to go with a short or a sell position with because the invalidation level with all of those short positions right here is going to stay exactly the same. So we are looking for a short at the weekly, at the 0.5, maybe at the golden Fibonacci ratio. And I would actually say that the stop loss placement for all of them is the same, simply above our previous high. Because the moment we break our previous high, this specific bearish alley wave contract here is going to get completely invalidated and we are looking for higher. And our higher target right here is going to be the weekly level at 50,776 US dollars. Now, let me also right now share with you why this weekly level right here, it's still a possibility. Now, again, when we talk about the trend, yes, first of all, we do want to see the cross of our exponential moving averages for us to say that we do have a higher probability to continue lower towards downside. But the moment we are going to start breaking our previous high, of course, our bearish plan right here is going to be invalidated and we are going to look for the next very important Fibonacci levels. So we are actually going to go on the Coinbase chart. Let's go on the weekly. And again, we are using the logarithmic chart because we are pulling some significant Fibonacci levels. Here you're going to notice one to one Fibonacci extension aligning almost to the exact dollar accuracy with our 0.786 Fibonacci retracement level aligning almost perfectly with our weekly high term time frame area of resistance. So I would say like that, if Bitcoin does continue higher, if our bearish elite wave contract here is going to be invalidated, or also if we do see a push towards the upside right now Bitcoin on a significant volume, we are going to know that this move right here is most probably not going to be our second elite wave. We are looking for higher and our higher target is simply going to be approximately 50,000 US dollars. Now, why am I saying that I am as of right now still prepared for another potential push towards the upside is simply because some of the indicators are as of right now still quite bullish. For example, if we go with our Ethler Stochastic CG oscillator, or also if we right now apply the RSI indicator on our chart, let's go on the weekly time frame. Here, we are going to notice that Ethler Stochastic is oversold, which in my opinion, it's quite a bullish indication for Bitcoin. And on the daily time frame, Bitcoin is forming quite a significant hidden bullish divergence on the RSI indicator. So I would say there are right now possibilities that we are going to go slightly higher, but I would still say the price target that was hit a couple of days ago, or maybe even if we are going to go slightly higher and actually hit the 50,000 US dollars area are significant price targets where personally, I'm actually even looking to take some profits out of my spot holdings, not only on Bitcoin, but also on majority of the altcoins. So how can right now we be prepared to go with a brand new short or a sell position and also where we can be looking for a brand new long or a buy position on the Bitcoin price itself. Now, as of right now, yes, we are forming a CVD bullish divergence, which means that traders are actually going with a short or a sell position, not able to move the price lower. That is why we are forming a slightly higher low. 
absorption happening, bullish absorption happening, which is a bullish indication for the Bitcoin price itself. So I would say like that, the most important thing that right now we should monitor is going to be the reaction at our weekly at our 0.5 or the golden Fibonacci ratio. And if the entire move towards the upside is going to be happening on a lower volume. That being said, if the volume is still be going lower and lower and lower, if the move is going to look some kind of an ABC correction towards the upside right here, I would simply say, look for the reaction at our important key levels right here. Simply fire a short or a sell position with a super clear invalidation level above the high. The moment we break the high, we are looking for higher. And as mentioned before, we are simply looking for our very important Fibonacci price targets to be hit. Let's just say approximately at 50,000 US dollars. And if you want to trade with us, 30,000 US dollar free trading bonus is available on Bybit. With BingX, there is no KYC and a 5,000 US dollar free trading bonus. But thank you very much if you're right now actually smashed up the like button have a great day and peace out